On the heels of the Quebec election, KTV spoke with Grand Chief Mike DeLille about the outcome, some comments on the future, and what the Liberal Party holding office could mean for Ganoage. Well, I think given the quickness of the election, 33 days, uh, very harried and at this point storied comments that she as well as other parts of her party made, there's no surprise. Uh, I wasn't expecting the landslide that happened last night, but um, they did everything in the wrong way to not get re-elected, whether it be in a minority as they were in a position or hopefully hoping that when they called the election they would have a majority. So it, it was a terrible campaign. I think Philip Couillard at least maintained some decorum and uh, produced a clean slate, so to speak, uh, and now we'll be dealing with the Liberals. I'm, I'm happy uh, that whether it be Liberal or uh, Parti Québécois that we'll be now dealing with a majority government. Uh, I think we'll get things done a little bit quicker, i.e. hospital particularly and, and possibly others, but you're always better off dealing with a majority government, uh, at least if they're not conservative in federal seats. But um, I won't say I'm sad to see her go uh, based on comments about the proposed charter and or referendum eventually if they would have got majority, but uh, I believe Ganawagi is in a much better position than we were yesterday or, or in the last 33 days, dealing with a Liberal government of many familiar faces, people that we've dealt with before, Jeff Kelly for example, Pierre Moreau and Shadigui for example as pre uh, previous Transport Minister and Indian Affairs respectively in, in terms of Kelly. So. I'm pleased with the uh, outcome and uh, ready to go to work. It bodes well for Ganawage. Uh, Mr. Couillard's campaign was based on economy, job creation, a lot of the same issues that Ganawage is facing and the Mohawk Council of Ganawage has been facing for the last several years. They're in control of the bigger picture in terms of Quebec, but I think any offshoots, spin-offs in terms of job creation and economic development can only be bettered through our interaction with them, us, Devodan Izakta, we already have a table under uh, quebec Kanawagi relations dealing exactly with that. So I, I think big picture it works well in our favor to do some of these things. Like I said, maybe even the hospital gets going a little bit quicker than it's been uh, in terms of those labor relations and some of the angst going back and forth because it was originally signed under them. So. Uh, looking forward to it. Uh, I think big picture it, it works well for Ganawage and given again the faces that are there, I'm confident that we'll be able to not only look for Ganawage's best interests but Quebec's as well because I mean they're a, a subdivision of Ganawage so to speak uh, and I'm sure the Quebec chiefs would say the same thing. Um, we're looking for pieces of the pie as well and, and I think because their focus is that, it's very similar to ours, that uh, we'll be able to get a lot done in the next four or five years and probably beyond that if we're looking real big picture because of the beating that the Parsi Quebecois took. I think they're really not even in the back seat, probably in the trunk right now. It's going to take a long time to, for them to recover. So I think the stability of the Liberal government over the next maybe even 10 years and beyond will, will help Ganawagi economy grow in lieu of Quebec economy. So I, I think the partnership will work well.